than before. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. you can see she's coming in harder. Yeah. Uh, yeah. For yeah. God, you can you can just I know that. Yeah. yeah. And then um, with the word. Yeah. yeah. So what you have to do is you have to when when it when it's said and hits you inside your your stomach your spirit where God is, not your head because you won't remember. Right. That's true. That's it's true. in your spirit. Yeah. Right. Amen. And then you have to write it down so you can chew on that and make it make it yours. Yeah. Right. You have to make that work in your life. Right. That's right. Amen. And here in Daniel, there's a great change that was taking place in Daniel's life, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego's life. They were moving from one uh, uh, place of uh, captivity to another place. Of captivity right. under this uh, under this king, and but never, never, nevertheless, it was God's will going to be done through them, right. and that He would He would speak to the, the leader, but the leader would not know mm -hmm. uh, what's going on. It would be right. through the through the men that was there in captivity that were known. It's and, and unfortunately, that's how it is. That's just the way that it is. Right. You want to be on top, but that's just not the way that God works it. I mean, his own son Boy. came and, and was uh, under the regime of a, a, of a, a um, almost a renegade Pharisee and Sadducee. They, were, they wasn't raised to be that way. Boy. But they had gone in the way of the flesh. And uh, they were about their own selves, and they, that's why they brought money into the into the temple, right. into the church. Right. And we have the same stuff going today. Nothing different. Yeah. Right. We have the same stuff today. When they go into, yeah. um, you know, my tapes and my books, and that's that's okay. But when they go on and on, and I'm going to yeah. give no, 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 no. Right. That's the same spirit. Right. Even though we do take time for the tithe and the offering. But we do it not for our gain. We do it for the benefit of the church. Yeah. And if you don't know that, I'm sorry. Right. Sorry. Right. 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 But we do it for the benefit of the church because right. these miracles are taking yes. place yeah. every day. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And you can be a part of it. Yeah. 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 But so there's a major change that takes place, and that's where we're at. Right. And um, here... We find we find that we, we we dealt with this last week about how their their names were changed. Remember, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And and I dealt what happened about the name being changed, which means the nature has to change. Right. Right. And that's what happens with uh, you know what's happening in your life is to change you yeah. so that Christ would be formed in you, and that the the sweet fragrance of Jesus. Would come yeah. through you, yeah. Yeah. not our flesh, yeah. right? Yeah. And and so uh, Daniel had made up his mind, no matter what happened, that they changed his name, he would not change. Right. And then it, there was a battle in verse eight, in uh, Daniel chapter one and verse eight, and we did go over some of these things, but I've got to go over a little bit closer for you to see, right. so that you can realize that this is where we are. And where you are in your life. It said, verse 8, And Daniel made up his mind that he would not defile himself with the king's choice food. Well, it's the same thing today. You have to make up your mind. Right. On your job, right. you got to make up your mind with your friends. Right. you got to make up your mind. you got to make up your mind with your friends that... that, that are you going to go with your friends or are you going to go with Jesus? Because you're going to have to choose. Right. 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 And they, they, you have to choose and you have to make them choose or they will make you choose. Right. 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 And they will do everything in their power to make you drop this thing about right. Jesus. Right. Right. Yep. Right. And they don't believe, but if you won't break, Right. And God will break them. Right. Right. Yeah. But you have to make up your mind. Yes, sir. No matter what comes to our pocket. And I every friend that I ever had, I do not have now. Right. 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 Right.
Yeah. And there are a few of my friends, that's two, so you can understand not a grip, that's not a grip low, that have come back. Amen. Right. And was and still friends. Amen. One is Danny Wu. Yes, that's right. A Korean. And he and he you never met him because he didn't want to meet you. <laughs> because he was afraid. And he, 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 didn't, he didn't know what you would think about it. I told him, I said, they love you. Right. I said, they'll love you because I love you. Right. 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 But we, he doesn't know about Jesus, even though he didn't even receive Jesus. Right. That's right. one. I, I can run down the road on that. Amen. But that's a different story. But he did. I, he, we got Jesus there. Amen. And he wasn't there before. Bruce Lee was there and Buddha was there. Right. And I think right. Bruce Lee before Buddha. Amen. Right. <laughs> right. And then my other friend, uh, Mark Cargill, was my, actually, my, let's see, uh, yeah, Mark would be my first friend when I, we moved from 71st and Florence to 124th in Raymond in L.A. I, I, I looked over the fence and there he was at uh, 12. And we became friends right then. Amen. Amen. And um, that's when... Uh, his mother, that would she teaches uh, piano. She still teaches piano lessons now. Wow! Wow! And um, and Mark is a violinist, and his his mother was teaching uh, piano lessons, and I heard an impossible dream. Yeah. Wow. And when I heard it, it it struck a chord so deep within me that I can't even put words to it. And then I asked Mark. I I, I said, Mark, can you play that? He said, yeah. I said, can you play that with your mother? I'd like to hear that. And they were surprised because his friends don't want to hear his Amen. mother right. nor Amen. him. They right. said, like, what, you know, right. we don't want to hear no right. violin. Right. Right. And then he, anyway, so he is still my friend uh, to this day. Amen. Amen. A dear friend. Amen. And when I was hospitalized, I don't even know how he found out. But he found out and he was here. Wow. Amen. One of my, and then my other friend, I won't mention his name, but he throwed me down uh, because he wanted to, he wanted the world, right. and we were very close. Right. But he will come back. That's yeah. right. Yeah. And I, I do know that. But my point is, it don't make a difference. Right. I'm not going to stop serving God. Right. Right. Amen. Amen. Right. It don't make no difference. And one another thing that I found out, and I've said this before. Um, I've said this to Cookie and I've said this in the church, but people, they only gravitate to what you say that's negative. Right. Yeah, right. But I found out that over the years, uh, my best friend is, is Cookie right. and her girlfriend. Right. Yes. Right. Right. I found out, that's what I found out. Right. 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 That, you know, just living, I found out that the one next to me yeah. is my best friend. Right. All along, I said, that's my wife. Right. So that's not my best friend. Right. Now, I know you people are married and your best friend is your spouse and all that. That's the way I think. <laughs> but I realize that that's, that's what it has been. Because I'm a little slow. <laughs> Thank you, John. My God, you people are very slow. <laughs> but anyway, so um, you, you, have a, you have to make up your mind. Yes. And I said, uh, no matter what, let me, let me just push on here. So Daniel, they said to him that he, he was supposed to eat the food like the king. Right, right. Uh -huh. And he said that he, that he, he did, would not. Right. And that he, he would not drink the wine. Right. But notice how he did it. He sought permission. Yes. Right. 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 So he had made up his mind in his heart, but he had not vocalized it right. Right. for danger because you got to be smart. Right. That's like going to the job and talking about you're smarter than everybody at the job right. and, and you just got there. You just got there. Right. You know more than, you don't even know the owner, but you know more than the owner. Right. And you know what the owner needs to do, and even though it's a billion dollar company, you know what the owner needs to do. You don't even, you don't even have a high school uh, 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 diploma. You have the DAD, or whatever they call it. What is it? It's the DMV. You got the DMV. You got it. 
You got a dust cap on your head, and you talking stupid is what it is. You got that? And how the person needs to be doing and all that? That's why you terminated. That's you don't go in there like that. You go in there, you humble. You're happy to have the job. Yeah. You're grateful to have the job. That's the way you got to be, and that can never change. Right. Man. You can never change that. Right. And so he submitted. He asked for permission from the commander of the officials that he might not defile himself. Notice that. Right. So he made his mind up first. Right. That's it. That's what you got to do. That's it. You got to say before I put myself on the dating game, I got to make my mind up that I'm not going to be sleeping. With the person, right. whoever it is, no matter how much pressure he or she is putting, right. you people, you men that love men now, oh. you still have to make sure that you. <laughs> you can't defile yourself. Right. Now that was only to see. I'm just checking you. Right. You defiling yourself and got a good shot. Right. I'm making hell. Yeah. Yeah. Great shot. Lesbians and uh, <laughs> bunnies. <laughs> which is the same. Male and female. They're both bunnies. Have a great shot of making hell. You want chapter and verse? The prophet can help you with that. Gabriel. What God hates. Okay. Daniel said he made his mind up and then he, he submitted what, it, what was in his heart. Yes. Yes. And it said, verse 9, then God granted Daniel favor. Yeah. Right. yeah. Come on. Yes. This is big time. Yes. Right. You got to have this. Yes. In this world that you live in, you yeah. got to have this. Yes. But you cannot have this without doing the other first. Right. Right. You have to make up your mind that you're going with God. Yeah. That's right. No matter what. Yeah, that's right. Tebow, the football player, the Heisman Trophy winner, and uh, uh, what's the other thing, college he won? National championship. Yeah, national championship several times. That's right. He, and then he went into the NFL. They actually blackballed him. Right. And they said it because he's not a quarterback and well, he didn't have the skills. How stupid is that? How stupid is that? Right. You people that don't know nothing about sports, that's why you're looking at it. Right. Don't worry. <laughs> don't worry about that. Right. I just told you the man was a Heisman Trophy winner. Right. That means that everybody that has a, 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 something to say about the, the collision, the best, right. exactly. picked him. Right. As the best for the year, right. they picked him collegially to best, and then he led his team as a quarterback right. to the championship. Right. Not once, but twice. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Then he goes into in, into the NFL, and they said they start attacking him. Right. Why? Because he never stopped. Holding the standard of Jesus. And he's not even spirit filled. Right. Right. Come on. I, I'm not sure what he is other than a good, probably a good Baptist. Right. Because them Baptists, they real strong. Yeah. Right. That's right. Right. Yeah. They bold and they strong. Right. They just like John. Right. That's John the Baptist. Right. John the Baptist was bold. And those Baptists are bold, and those Baptists are strong. Yeah. That's, right. That's, right. That's, right. That's right. And it don't matter what color they are. Right. Right. If they say Baptist, they Baptist and they strong. Right. 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 And they good preachers too. Right. Right. Now they will get you baptized and saved every week. Right. 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 So you, you, you don't get much more than that, right. but you will know how to be a good Baptist. Right. 
And they, 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 they preached fire and brimstone. Because that's what John did. John preached fire and brimstone. Those Baptists preached fire and brimstone. And this society, so you may not like it, but them black Baptists, I'm talking about them preachers. I don't think, I ain't never seen nobody out preach them boys. Right. I'm not even thinking about trying out to preach them boys. They say they talk about how you have the corn and they shuck the corn. That's how you take the the, the, the what is the kernel off of the off of the, the, the cob. Them boys don't leave not one on there. They break it all down every time. When the Baptists get, when they get done, you know it. You've been up and down. They've been up and down on your head. If you stay in their, their service, you go into the altar. That's right. Yeah. I'm telling you. Yeah. You cannot stay in their service unless you're deaf and dumb. And if they got somebody doing the sign language, you still go into the altar. Because you can't stay in there. It's too hot. Yeah. Right. You got to get out. Yeah. Yeah. Now how we can we how can we let a Baptist outdo us? Why? We're supposed to be spirit filled Why? and tongue talkers Why? and hiding in the bushes. Why? Afraid and don't want nobody to know. Yeah. Well you know you're not talking to tongues. Why? Why? It said look right this verse verse and I, I gotta look I I looked up the the word uh, favor. And I also looked up the word compassion because it said God granted favor and compassion. Yeah. That's not the right one. Here we go. Which one is this? Oh, this is too much. This is compassion. That's before. That's not right. I gotta go. Gotta go to my uh, look. Look at these books. I punished Christopher today, and these two. Then these two, and then the radio. Mm -hmm. I said, Christopher, are you gonna better take it? He looked, you can see in his eyes. I made, I said, <laughs> I can do it. I said, you're not gonna drop it? I said, because somebody dropped my stuff. Right. He said, what? And I said, yeah. I said, Al, drop my shawl, the bishop's shawl. What a bishop wear. Right. You know that nobody, anybody can't right. touch the bishop clothes? Did you know that? Right. That he has an attendant to his clothes? That's right. And Al dropped mine on the ground where, where people walk? <laughs> the coach? The head coach? I said, I bet you used to fumble the ball when you came back. <laughs> You outrun everybody, you're strong as a board, and you catch them. <laughs> Fumble the ball. I gotta give it to Al. I don't know, some of them I just gotta give it to them. Yeah. But you know why? You know why, you guys, uh, uh, Shay and, and, and uh, uh, Devin? Because then, boy, he be giving it to you guys. Right. And giving it to Gabriel. Right. Right. All those that, that Al is trained, he's yeah. giving it to you. Right. Yeah. You leave from him, you you pardon. Right. He, he like it. Right. He like right. it. So we gotta get him back some kind of way. Right. Amen. No way you can get him in us in in the workout things, you gotta try to sneak up behind him and hit him in the head or something. <laughs> but anyway, favor. Yeah. It said God granted. After you make that decision in your heart, God grants you favor. Yes. And you have to find that favor. Yes. Now you want to know what you notice who granted it. It's not brown nosing. No. Right. Right. It's you, you the place where you should, you're supposed to be. Yeah. And God will give you favor if you are faithful. Yes. 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 Get that now what I just said. God will give you favor yes. if you are faithful. Right. Right. Thank you, Lord. Right. Now favor means... A kind or friendly attitude. That's the first thing. A kind or friendly attitude. 
Number two, a kind act. Favor. Amen. All right. An indulgence. Privilege. Friendly regard and approval Amen. shown yeah. by a supervisor. Yeah. Amen. Right. Right. Yeah. Partiality. Yes. Right. Okay. That's favor. Amen. Amen. The condition of being held in this regard is favor. Right. Right. Approval yeah. or support. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. That's right. There's one I got to pass over. If it was a man, I could give it. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking, where's Gladney? I was thinking, Gladney's taping me, Gabriel. You boys are always talking. Gladney's taping me. I said, we maybe need to. What do they call that when you censor the person's tape? We, we may need to. I'm talking about when he's got me taping me on the men's oh, meeting. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because who knows, because Phillips is, right. and we need to check Philip too. Right. <laughs> we need to check him out. Yeah. How's he filtering that information to Ricky? Right. We need to watch these boys. Right. Yeah. They taping me. My God, can you imagine? They did Trump what they did to him yeah. when he said in a bus 11 years ago. Do you know what they'll do to me when I just said Saturday? Saturday. I said, my God, that's a bishop? You see the way I am? I said, yeah, yeah. But they just come up with all kind of mess right. to crucify me. Yes. Right. But see, when you're a leader right. and you're a missile, right. the missile's just going. Right. They told that to Cookie, that's one of the first prophecies. Right. They said he's like, he's like a missile. Right. Amen. And you just got to let him run. Right. <laughs> And then I forgot, oh, I, I can give the prophecy to her, but I am not going to say that now. It was about me, so I, I need to. <laughs> <laughs> I can give another one about her, though. He said, uh, I, I wear a lion that I, that I made many years ago. Uh, over a decade. No, no, over, what's 20 years? Two decades. Two decades. Closer to three decades. Right. Yeah. And they said the, the lion, the, 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 the diamonds in the lion's eyes, said, the Lord said, one diamond is my eye, mm -hmm. and the other diamond is Cookie's eye. Right. And I was like, Lord, can't you change that one? I don't mind the one, but can you change that other one? Why is her eye got to be the other eye of the lion? That's just the way God's, what he says. Right. <coughs> it has been the truth. Yeah. Man. Uh, yes. Helped me out so many times. Yeah, I'm such a bull. My my wife said, You gotta turn right here. I said, I know where I, I know where I gotta turn. But sometimes she if she don't tell me I'm going straight. Right. <laughs> Especially if you're going straight all the time. <laughs> she know oh he can make go straight. I have been tell him, turn right here. But I'm such a bull, I say, oh, yeah, I know, I know where to go. <laughs> but then sometimes I say, it's the truth. Sometimes I say, I, I, I forgot. Right. Now, in other words, I'm not, I don't boil over, Cookie, even though people do think that. I, that's not my heart. You think somebody going to stay with you 41 years? Right. If I was bullying and running over her? I'm a champion for her, and I'm a champion for women. Right. I am. But if you listen to me when you think I'm one-sided, that's because you don't know the other side. Right. Right. And because I'm teaching in the church the order and the government of God in the house of God. Right. So that's different. Right. 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 
Right. Then when we outside of being the, the right. order of God and the, and the structure of God right. and the government of God is upon the shoulders of the men. Right. Not the women. Right. But it doesn't mean the woman doesn't have a place. Right. She does have a place. Right. And we let her, the women have their places. Right. If you don't know that, then you don't know. But I'm not going to, you won't like this, but I'm not putting a woman over the, the armies of, of our government. Right. I know she can't handle it. That's right. And if they do that, which I got a good shot that they're going to do that, you're going to see what's going to happen. Right. Not just what's going to happen to our government, you're going to see what's going to happen to the woman that they try to put the, the government of our government on her shoulder. She already collapsed. She will collapse again. Right. Mark it down for the powers that be. Okay, back over here now. It says the favor. Oh man, as soon as I hit that burden. That's the that's the that's the demons that are in places of power, and that's the women livers in here. And, and fighting for women's rights and <laughs> and uh, the right to kill your baby. Come on, Bishop. Come on. And what else? Um, the right to have another woman as your husband, or your wife. You have the right. Yeah, you, you do have the right to go to hell. We just trying to stop you from going to hell. But you have the right to go to hell. And those that want to be in hell, there's no shocker. Right. No shocks in hell. Why? Other than when you pass through that through the other side. <laughs> I didn't believe that. Right. Didn't like this. Right. right. Yeah, we made we made it so that you wouldn't believe. It. Right. Come on now. Yeah. And then they play all the time that you was told. Right. Wow. You decided not to believe. Okay. Back over here. Uh, a token of love yes. favors a token of love right. or remembrance. Number eight, a, a small gift given to guests at a, at a party. Yeah. Advantage, benefit, Anyway, it goes on, but that, that's enough. Right. That's eight, nine. I had to take. I had to delete one. Mm -hmm. You won't like that one. <laughs> okay. So that's favor. Right. Man. And God grants that I have two places in the scriptures right. to give you. Amen. Amen. Uh, I think I will give you Genesis. I was going to give you Jesus, but I think I will give you Genesis, where it says that Noah found favor. So let's go to Genesis 6 because this is where we're at, which is, this has happened I don't know how many times, Gabriel, in our nation, or in the, not in our nation, but in the nation of the world, how many times that this has happened? Where a nation has rose up. Uh, matter of fact, Nebuchadnezzar was the greatest nation at one time. Yes. And, uh, he he went mad, right? And he was in the field. That's right. Uh, matter of fact, he got hairy like an animal. Those are the people that yeah. think that we're animals. That's right. He got hairy like an animal, right. and even go, go grow long fingernails. That's right. That's right. And became like a like an animal. Right. And he was wild and crazy and out of his mind. Right. And they had to let him in the field. Yep. Right. Yep. That's because he thought he was God. And so God said, no, 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 no. You're not God. I am. So when he got, when he, when he uh, had enough of that feel, uh, I, mean, I don't know right now how long he was in there, but he was in there long enough to realize that hey, I made a terrible mistake. And I need to get back in my mind and, and get this, get this, this, this animal Plus, he's not showering or cleaning. Oh, There's none of that. Oh, right. 
It's like the animals. Yeah. But anyway, that's your free part. That's what happens to you when you, you want to, uh, you know, exit God out. Right. You become like an animal. And then the other thing is, is that you might wake up in hell. Right. Okay. Genesis chapter 6. I want you to see this. And I know what I'm talking about. That's right. In verse 2 it says that the sons of God saw that the daughters of men were beautiful and they took wives for themselves whenever they, cho they chose. Verse 3, Then the Lord said, My spirit, notice capital S, yes. shall not always, shall not strive with man forever. Because he also is flesh. Right. Nevertheless, his days shall be 120 years. Right. Now it just was just shifted. Yeah. God shifted it. Right. He had it where man was never to die. Right. Then man sinned. And he told him that day you eat of this, the day you die. Right. right. But they they still because the in the in the economy of God, when it talks about the kingdom of God, it talk it's talking about a thousand year reign of yeah. Jesus. Right, right. That's what God always wanted. It's it's, it's symbolic. You got to understand. It's symbolic. And so, in this in this time, men live. You know, 900 years, 700 years, right. 600 right. years. Right. You know, Adam lived 900 some years. Right. Um, you know, they lived a long time. Yeah. Right. But he said, right here, because of what they're doing, right. God said that actually what's happened, he, he, he didn't shorten it, they shortened it. Right. That's what you got to understand. Yeah. God doesn't shorten your life, you shorten it. Right. Right. By the choices that you make. Yes. Right. Wow. Yeah. Right. And they blame it on God, but that's not what happened here. Right. He says he's, he's not going to strive with man because of what he had just did above that. Right. And I didn't even read verse 1 because I don't want, want to take the time. Where's Justin? <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, he told me about that. I, I let him go. He asked. He, he asked for permission. Amen. Like here. That we read earlier in Daniel. Right. And if I'd have told him to stay, he would have stayed. Right. Right. So I told him, go ahead. Because he's been faithful. Yes. Uh, he's really been trying. Uh, you can see he's coming early. He's even changed his dress. He, was, he fought hard. Yeah. <laughs> but he, he's a businessman. Right. Why do you want to look like a businessman like that? Right. Right. It just it, it don't work. It just don't work, especially if you're going to be owning quite a few businesses right. and be a multi-millionaire. Right. You're not going to be like that. Right. Right. Because you got to change here. Right. If you change here, you change here. Right. 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 That's right. You're not going to be meeting the President of the United States or some other great businessman like that. No. Right. No. Right. It's, just, it's just not going to happen. As a matter of fact, you may be looking for favor as soon as he sees that. Right. <laughs> He'll smile and never say nothing, but then he goes away. <laughs> He'll say to his, his attendant that's helping him, you make sure the money doesn't go to this person. <laughs> or, or somebody else with a, with a do-rag on. <laughs> Earrings in, in your ears. Matter, matter of fact, maybe even a, in a hoodie over the do-rag. <laughs> Yeah, come in, your butt out. <laughs> maybe, maybe sleeves where you tat it right. from the neck all the way through all tat it, right. and you want the person to see. Right. I'm cool, man. Right. Yeah. He says, "Nice meeting you." Yeah. He says, "When you go away, make sure right. you're not giving no money to that person nor their organization. Strike it." That's right. right. Or the same the woman that's got a lewd spirit. Right. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna use my lewdness, right. I'm gonna use my body right. to get to get the to pull this right. businessman. Right. right. He he's nice meeting you. And then 
Yeah. Which one are you talking about? You know the one I'm talking about. The one with the dress up too high. No stockings on. Breast out, butt out, everything out. No, nothing for her. Right. But a, a, a dear Mary letter right. <laughs> from John, the owner. Yeah. Okay, let's get back over here. He says 120 years. He says um, Neplin, or whatever that name is, was on the earth in those days. Who is that? It's the giants. Giants, giants in the land. Right. And also after that, when the giants are still here because you see me. Yeah. Yeah. When the sons of God came into the door of the men, they were born uh, children to them. And those were the mighty men who were of old men of renown. Verse 5, uh, am, I, am, I, am I going right here? Yeah. Then the Lord saw that the wickedness of man was great on the earth. This is where we are. Right. The Lord saw that the wickedness of man was great on the earth. Right. And that the, the very intent of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. <clears throat> now what happens with us it's because we don't know, uh, we don't, first of all, we don't want to know the truth. Right. We, don't, we don't even want to know what's in the heart of politicians. Right. Like right. we used to, we, we had to know. Right. They had to say even if they were lying. Right. They had to say, and then we would check it. Right. Now we have what it is supposed to be a separation of church and state. I told you that's a lie. Right. 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 It was to keep the, the, the state out of the church, not the church out of the state. Right. That's right, Bishop. And so it says here, you better pay attention. Yeah. I was I was gonna run and give you the the humanist the humanist mentality. Right. Um but I, I don't want to take the time. It just grieved God. It says here that the Lord saw that the wickedness of man was great on the earth and that every intention of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. That's where we are. Not everybody, but it's a large majority. Amen. Right. Verse 6, And that the Lord was sorry that he had made man wow. on the earth. Right. And he was grieved in his heart. Right. For those that think that God does not grieve, right. it shows you right here that he does. Right. Right. Shows you that when he, when he does something, and he knew this time would come, it wasn't like he was shocked. He knew this wouldn't come, but you gotta understand, when you gotta understand God. God does not see evil. Even though he can. He doesn't see that you do evil even though he can see. His his hope, I was telling somebody today on the phone about, about faith. Yes. And about faith being the greatest gift yes. Yes. besides Jesus, right. which is an unspeakable gift. Yes. Yeah. That's the greatest gift known to man, which is God's faith put in a vessel. Right. Which is a, which is a spark or just a piece of him. Right. Yeah. You gotta understand what I'm telling you, you gotta follow me now. Right. He, he has get him get him still over there, Bill. I don't need him clapping and all this over here while, I, while I'm ministering. Good, good. The, the faith of God is a spark which he puts in a vessel yeah. that from him, that he is, that's what he is. Yeah. Right. He is faith. He is love. Yeah. Right. He is power. Right. Yeah. Right. He is the Almighty. Yeah. Right. But, but when he puts this faith, you got to understand, 
It's from him. That's what he is. Yes. So when he says something, he's not worried. Like, is this going to happen? Right. All right. right. All right. You right. got to understand. You got to get what I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. Yes. When God says something, he has no doubt. Right. 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 All right. No doubt. Yes, sir. Right. No doubt. Come on. That what he says is going to happen. Yes. He yes. never thinks, oh, my goodness. What if no, he don't think like that. Right. Right. He cannot think like that. Right. You got to understand what I'm telling you. Right. He yes. cannot think like that. Right. Because he's full. Yes. Yeah. Of faith. Yeah. He's full of power. Yeah. 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 He's fully committed that when he says something, no matter how many weeks, months, years, or centuries it takes for something to come to pass, when he says it, he knows. Yeah. 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 He has no doubt yeah. that it will come to pass. Yes, sir. Because he's full of faith. Yeah. Okay, see you. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I was so excited. It's not the same as what I'm telling you because you're. Uh -huh. You're. Come on. <laughs> is he really talking about me? Huh. <laughs> How could right. that, you know, that all that stuff? Yeah. Right. right. No, when he says that he's talking about you. Yeah. Right. When he says in the word, he says, you know, that all the, 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 the earth will be filled. Yeah. Right. 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 Yes. You and everybody else. Right. right. Oh, amen. That's right. Will be filled with the knowledge of, of the, 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 the word as the glory of the Lord fills the earth. Amen. Anyway, it says that God was grieved in his heart, and the Lord said, I will blot out man from whom I created from the face of the land. From man to animals, to creeping things, so you can understand it's not, not personal, he's going to wipe everybody out. Right. Man, two animals, so they're not together. Right. To creeping things, right. to birds, to the sky. For I am sorry that I may have made them. Mm. It says, but, but. Right. That's a big one. Yeah. A big but. Yeah. Right. No found favor. Yeah. In the eyes of the Lord, the Lord knew all along that He was going to grant no. He knew He knew Noah was His, was his boy. Wow. That's right. Amen. He had picked him from the beginning. Yes. Right. Are you hearing me? Yes. 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 But he was he was walking through with his what you know about how He created man. Why? Right. And the giants in the land and the angels. He, 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 it's all here in, in chapter six. I ain't got time to get into that. This is verse 9. And these are the records of the generations of Noah. Noah was a righteous man. Right, right. Blameless in his time. Yes. Right. Right. And Noah walked with God. Yes. Yes. Yes, amen. You go and look and see how many men that walk with God. Right. You cannot count them on one hand. Right. Right. Wow. That's right. And there are thousands. Of men that knew God. Right. Wow. Millions of men that God has picked. Right. But to say that a man walked with God. Right. Not even on one hand, it's not even five. Right. In the in the Bible that right. says that that man walked with God. Right. So you can see God is not easily to walk with. Right. Right. Yeah. That's right. right. And those that follow me will find it out. Right. Amen. Right, Bishop. Christopher finds out already. Right. Christopher's all goo goo eye. He right. picked his girl on the internet. <laughs> they picked each other on the internet. It's a great way. Flesh. Right. To find flesh. Right. Right. Christopher is all marching for weeks and months and years. And she was even here like she was in. Right. But she was not in because right. her time came. Right. And she showed that she was not in, and she rose up what was in her heart all along and told Christopher, if you go with those people, he, she, she told him this always happens. Always, not just Christopher, I just use Christopher. They all do this. Me or them. Always. You want to go with them, that church, that cult, 
Where they say God is and he's not there. Bishops in control, strong right arm. Can dominate women. That's all of all the stuff. And his son's worse than him. That's all the stuff. That's all the, all the foolishness that's coming down the pipe. You have to choose who you're going to go with. Christopher was rocking when she put it on. But Christopher had a relationship. Number one with God and he had a relationship with the leaders. Not just me, not just Gabriel, but my wife. Lady died. Amen. His mother. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Amen. So he was able to lean on the leaders right. and come clean and get his soul from being the soul tie. Right. You got to watch it now. You don't know about soul ties. Right. You think right. they're flesh. They're, right. they're, you think they're spirit. God let no. Soul tie. Right. Right. Soul tie. Tied in with the soul. Right. Locked in with the soul. Right. Right. Very difficult to break. Right. Yeah. There was a soul tie. Yeah. But I'm proud of you, son. Yeah. yeah. Proud of you. Because yeah. he hung tough. Hallelujah. Hung tough. Yeah. Now the right woman, because there's still work that needs to be done, because that, that marriage would have never worked anyway. Right. Christopher, right. you would have had the big D. Right. On your head, Big D with three children. Right. And we found out just the other day that they're 400 ahead. Right, right, right. That's right. You used to be two, 250 if they upgraded. Right. Yeah. yeah. And you, for all of you people that make more money, it's more. Right. My brother was paying a nickel ahead. Plus alimony, another nickel. Right. And insurance. Right. And uh, parochial school. Right. He was about 2500 a month, my brother. <laughs> That's what the big D would do for you. That's divorce if you don't know what it is. Right. <laughs> and if you don't have it right and you're in the wrong place, soul tie, yep. got a woman that is whispering in, <coughs> telling you what you should be doing, she, she don't have no man. Right. She's had multiple men. Right. Maybe somebody living with her now but no husband. Right. And she's telling you right. what you need right. to do with your relationship and you're listening. Right. You and her are out having... Uh, Cocktail <laughs> after work. What's wrong with that? Right. She's telling you what you need to be doing. Right. You're not listening to the prophetess. Right. You don't listen to the lady right. die. You're right. not going to the women's right. love feast. Right. You don't have time. Right. <laughs> but you got time to get that cocktail. Right. You got time to go to the club and shake your booty. I always like to shake my booty. I always like to dance. God made me to dance. You know how long I've been hearing that stupidness? Right. Oh, here's another one that I get back. The woman says, you say, who's that? Who's that Negro right there? He's just a friend. Right. Soon as I hear that, Jeff. Right. Soon as I hear that, I go, oh. Okay. Now, some of you think because I said the Negro that it don't count. Right. I can say other things. I just, I just ran in there to give some of you a break. Yeah. I can run some other things. Right. Right. Just put it, put mail. Right. Who's that mail right there? Right. Always following you around. Who's, right. He's just a friend. Right. Okay. Right. Okay, let's get back over here now. Noah walked with God. Yeah. 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 Now, let, let's go over here to Genesis, I mean, uh, to, to Luke chapter 2. So we can see who else found favor. I gave, told you what favor was. Right. Noah found favor, saved that nation, saved his family, 
and save and save our our uh, mankind actually save mankind go to Luke chapter 2 man no problem you did it yourself Christopher I just recognized it and we all know We don't know, you know, we, we all have been suffering. We yeah. suffered. Yeah. We know about soul ties. Yeah. Yeah. You know, when you go through something, you, you have a personal deal with it. Yeah. Yeah. But we all know suffering. We all know uh, pain. Yeah. And uh, we know the goodness of the Lord. Yeah. Right. Amen. Yeah. And I'm teaching the way of the, in the flow of the Spirit. Yeah. And so uh, the the God will bring the right woman, and you won't yeah. search. And the other thing is, what happens is that you go right back and go to the same pattern that got you in the mess before. Yeah. Right. And I knew by the spirit that Christopher did the same thing. I said, you went back on the internet. Right. I said it by the spirit. His head down. <laughs> I see. I just knew. All of a sudden, it just came to me. And he did the God said he did the same thing again. I said, Oh no. Couldn't he? Yeah, yeah, he did the same. And we all do. Not just him. We all do the same thing. Yeah, right. I wanted to talk about uh, I gotta get it in there too. Let's see. I, I wanted to talk about the food with Daniel and I I brought it out, but I, I didn't go into it. And I want to say, um, that's a very difficult thing to do. To change the food and, and God is doing that. Yeah. Change your diet. Yeah. Yes. Which changes your life yes. and prolongs your life. Now, with my wife and me, my wife has been on this course many years before me. If I would have followed her in when she was making the change with the food, but you see, with me, I'm I'm a different animal, and I'm not making excuses. I'm just talking about me and how I am. When when uh, when my mother made breakfasts back in the day. I, I thought that was the best thing in the world. All right. <laughs> All right. Yes. I remember when they separated me from my brothers and sisters and sent me to Louisiana to live with my mother's sister by myself. And I have, uh, it's five of us, three boys and two girls. And I'm separated from my, from my family and living with actually a, 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 a uh, the, 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 my auntie was my, a, my mother's stepsister. And that meant a lot of different things, you got to understand. Yeah. And she felt that I was too, too heavy, even though I really wasn't, but she felt I was. And so she put me on a diet. <laughs> oh, and I went immediately from this wonderful breakfast that my mother would make. <laughs> and you know, I don't know if it was one egg or, I don't know, I don't remember now, but maybe one egg, but bacon and eggs and toast and, you know, grits. You know, just wonderful breakfast. I love breakfasts. Amen. I still Amen. love breakfasts. Yes. Amen. Cookie right. made me a great breakfast just on Sunday. Amen. And uh, she made me Louisiana sausage and eggs. <laughs> and I don't know if she had put some grits, but she put some, I had my last two pieces of French, French bread. She put my French bread on there. And I don't drink coffee because I don't want to stunt my growth. <laughs> but when I have breakfast, I ask her to, to make me coffee. And I have coffee. I like to have coffee. And I don't drink the whole cup. But I have, I have one that's hot I like to have with my breakfast. Yeah. I just had it Sunday. And, uh, when I, and I forget now, I was in the fourth grade, and so I'm not sure how old that makes you be. I don't know, maybe, I don't know, 10, 9, 10, somewhere in there. And so I'm, that's my age, and I'm in Louisiana, and I'm under a strict regime. <laughs> Just when I got there, everything in my life changed. I, 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 my, my aunt was a teacher, and she... Uh, she, she would 
I, I would come home early and I couldn't, I, she'd have the house locked. I couldn't get in the house. So I couldn't get nothing to eat. The house is locked. And then we, but we had next door, we had Miss Pauline, which was, you know, like a, a, a great aunt I and mean, a great cook. Mm. <laughs> I mean, them, them women in Louisiana, they can burn. Yeah. Now, some of you don't understand that, and I ain't got time to break that down. And then we had a, the, the, the lady next door to her was a lady named Shook. And uh, she, they didn't really have much, but they had, what they had was always offered to me. And I remember Miss Pauline told my mother, you need to take that boy home. Because of I being locked out at night, you know, waiting for my, my aunt to come home. And I remember I went to a post aid. I didn't even know what that was. I thought, you're going to have a post aid. What? Then it would come out. And I had a piece of toast, no butter on it. Mm. <laughs> my wife doesn't understand why I have to have my butter. Yeah. I have to have it. Yes, sir. And of course, there's a problem with, the, you know, listen, you can be on the other side with the organic, but there's also extreme over there. Right. See, I'm in the middle of the road. Now, I'm not now, but I'm, I'm for the middle of the road. Right. Because I want a little seasoned, a little salt, right. which is seasoned salt, and I have a new one. Now, what's my new one? Himalayan. Yeah, I have a new one. It's better than season. Yeah. And I very seldom even use it now that I have it. But anyway, so I'm trying to get to the middle road, but then we have the other on the other end that's that's on the far end, and I can't go that far. Right, right. But my wife, as I said, has been leading me to the right path, and if I would have listened to her, I would have never had, uh, I would not be on dialysis. Right, wow. I would not be the weight that I am. I would not have anything that's attacked me that has attacked me right. if I would listen to my wife wow. and follow her. It's not that I don't listen. I do listen to my wife, but I, I don't follow her real close sometimes. When it's, when it's uh, you know, when you want to deal with my, when you want to get in my breakfast. Right. Just put that, let's just put it like that. Right. So, um, and what I'm trying to say to you is, is that I have not given up right. because something has been difficult. Amen. All right. Amen. All right. I recognize where I am. Yeah. I'm not Philip, where's Philip and Chrissy? I'm not going to be in condemnation, where's Philip? I'm not going to be in condemnation, Philip. I mean, I deal with what it is, Ray. I got to deal with what it is. And I say, and I, I have something that most people don't have. Right. Right. The gift of faith resides in me, which is a bit of God's faith that he put inside of me. And I know with that, and I can come all the way back, which I am proving. Yeah. Amen. And I will not give up, and as I'm trying to encourage the church, that you may have constantly, you know, some of you say, well, that's just, that's ridiculous, Bishop. I'm sure my wife thinks that's just why he should have just. I, I've been. He's preaching probably tells my mother, probably tell her over 20 years ago. So they always be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've been telling Michael. And then my mother whips Cookie, too. Just whips her. And, and you should have. And you give my son what he's supposed to have. She doesn't know. My mother doesn't understand. That's not the way it's run in my house. The women, the woman, the woman does not run my house. I. Right. I. Run my house. Right. And I don't say that trying to. That's just what I am. Right. Amen. It must be something because why God should just leave me. Right. I had my run. Leave me. Right. I wakes me up from dead. Right. What? Go back. What is... right. Go back to that and the thing is dead. And look, he's dead. The body's dead. Heart done. Kidneys done. Right. Right. Come on, Bishop. Lungs done. Feet messed up. Let him leave me. Leave. What are you doing? Go back. What? 
Yeah. Okay. What are you going to do? Tell him no? <laughs> then you got this big old hole like this. So you can see all the way through from heaven all the way. <laughs> no means maybe. No, 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 no. Don't worry, Lord. We ain't, we ain't got no no in us. That's right. That's right. Now I'm not afraid of going to hell. But I don't want to go. And I don't want to tell him no. When I want to tell him yes, because you got to understand what I told you. That you, you, you know, it's in it's in God. Don't have no in Him, and He sees that we can do it. Right, right, right. And when you walk with Him, that's the way you can see. We, I see you guys that you can do it. We can do what He called us to do. That's right. Now, oh, back. Now, I never even told you to go to Daniel. I know, but I met Daniel. I told you I'd go to Daniel. I went to Daniel anyway. I've been telling you about Daniel and the food in Daniel. I didn't tell you. I told you to go to Luke, but I said I can't leave Daniel. I wanted to get this, and I had to get it in. I had to get it in about the food, the change of life. Right. Things have to change in your life if you yeah. want things to change. Yeah. If you want things to change in your marriage, you have to change. Yeah. Right. And you think you don't have to change, but you have to change. Yes. Right. If you're told you have to change, you have to change. Right. Right. And if you don't change it, it's going to be a problem down the road. And you realize, like I'm telling you now, if I were to listen, I wouldn't have some problems I got now. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. Those are warnings. Yeah. Those testimonies. Yeah. Yes. Got to get to the middle of the road. Yeah. And I gave you favor. I didn't even give you compassion. I don't have time to give you compassion. I do have the, 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 the definition. It's magnificent. There's, right. there's five words in the Hebrew language that, that, that gives you what compassion is. In the Hebrew, it's the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. And there's eight words in the Greek. Eight words that mean the one word. So when we hear compassion or we hear favor, we don't know how many words, Hebrew words, Greek words, the, the New Testament is written in Greek, the Old Testament is written in Hebrew. And so when God says something, it takes so many words for you to comprehend what he actually is saying. Right. 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 And I don't have time to get, I have the information, but I don't have time to get into it about compassion. Other than favor and compassion go together. Yeah. Yeah. Just like prophets, apostles and prophets go together. Yeah. They just go together. Um, what happened here in verse 10, we we'll give it a little bit more. And the commander of the, uh, the uh, officials said to Daniel, I'm afraid. This is something that happens. When God has given you favor through to someone that is in the system, this has to, process has to take place. Yeah. That's right. It has to be worked in their life. I'm talking about the leader or the, the, the supervisor, the person that's over you. Right. Yeah. yeah. Right. That's it. Your 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 eyes do not display your heart. Your eyes, as your soul, displays something else that your heart displays when you come and you and you hit the keys and your dem the demonstration of um, what you've done in this ministry shows your heart. Yeah. Yes. Amen. Not by your eyes and not by things that you say. You're changing still. Amen. Yes. You were friends with one of the ones that I said that affected you, infected you. But you have to shake that, that venom and that soul tie for you to come all the way right with this one here. Alan. Your husband. Amen. Amen. And that is happening. Yeah, it's a process. Yeah. 
Hallelujah. There has to be a change of venue. Yeah. The housing. For that to come right. Yes. Amen. Um, always dealing with the fear, and I don't have time to get into it about the fear, but it's a process. And um, Daniel we had to encourage the man, and then he said, "Okay." He would let. He said, "Let let let me test me and see." Yes. And then he brought his. His, uh, his friend Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego would have changed their names too. Mm -hmm. And said, test us and see. In other words, prove us out. Right. Yeah. Yes. All those that are listened and, and, and tested out, you'll find out, oh my God, there is miracles here. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah. My God, there are miracles here. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. This, these people do have something. Yeah. 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 That's right. Yeah. Amen. Glory to God. And I can get it. Right. Yeah. Yes. It's for me. Amen. Now they just come out of the hospital yesterday and is back in her spot right. today. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. That's what the hospital is for. That's what the hospital, that's what the system's for. One of the systems where my insurance is from, they send me a letter, watch this, and I'm gonna let you out. They send me a letter. And say we've cut into your money. This is the system because they want to take your money. Right. Oh yeah. We we we've already taken it. <laughs> right. Right. And I my administration helps me because that's not my strong point. You didn't hear what I just said. Yeah. Right. For my administrator, my secretary, my ministers, my my administrators, they help me. Right. And so now we know we got to listen now. Now we know when you're dealing with the system, you can't just send a letter and you can't just make a call. That's not good enough in the time that we're living. If you make a telephone call, you got to know who you talk to, what their name is, what's their number. How do you get in touch with them? If you send paperwork, and you say, I send on such and such a day, that means nothing. No. I have no proof. You have to send it certified just like they do you when they're going to do you. Right. That's right. They say you certified. Right. So when you're trying to stop, you better listen. When you try to stop them from doing you, you got to send them certified. Right. So now I got a letter saying they have already taken my money, right? And they whacked half of my insurance. They're going to do me. Matter of fact, they've already done me. They just give me, let me know on such and such a day, it'll be finished. So we said, no, wait, wait a minute here. We sent you paperwork a week ahead of time, and you received it because we have certified proof that you received. They say, what? Oh, no. They said, he's calling us on it. They go and they look right. and they go, oh my God. Lord. We he sent us the paperwork. It's here in our office over a week. We never even opened it. Mm. Wow. wow. My God. Mm. Our plan, that's a system, you gotta understand. It's not personal, it's a system. The system, you get see, you're not gonna you, you, you. come on. They're gonna take care of you. Yeah. <laughs> Matter of fact, you already in it, that's why you can't talk. <laughs> You're already in it. They got you. Yeah. But it's, they, they said, no, we proved that we have sent you the paperwork. They went and looked and searched and found it. And they said, now we got to undo what we did. And guess what? They said it'll take three months, Joe. Three months. For us to give back the money that we already ate from you. Three months. You no, know, you gotta understand. That's the system. That's just one system. That's insurance. I have others. Several others. I have the IRS that I've been dealing with. Not this is not the first time. But I'm dealing with. They 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 trying to make their maneuver. I listen. 
it, that, listen, you just got to learn. As long as you're here on this planet Earth, you can all stand. You, 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 as long as you're here on this planet Earth, you got to be ready to fight. Not, not physically, not with a knife, not with a gun. Not spitting and hollering. If you need an envelope, I saw many people already paying their tithe. If you need an envelope and you didn't get one yet, raise your hands. You want to get in the miracle bucket? You don't believe? I don't want you to raise your hand. Don't take an envelope. And I'm not trying to stop you. I'm just saying we want to keep the miracles working. I send a message to Joe, my friend. I like that man from the first time I seen him. Yeah. I didn't even know who he was or something connected that man. I like him. Amen. Now we got we we trying to work a deal. I said Amen. I told Joe, I said, I know you a good man. I know you good at what you do. I already know that. I said, you God's man for me. Right. Yeah. I said, but I'm looking for a miracle right. to make a maneuver. Yeah. So that we want the miracle to better continue to go on. Amen. Right. Not just for me, for, for everybody. everybody. And they ain't going to stop. Right. They ain't going to stop. There's houses in here. Yeah. You heard it today, that's why I don't want you to listen to it. Right. When I heard that, I had forgot. I had forgot. And he said, I knew one part, but I forgot. God said, I've always uh, appreciated you. He said, you've not always been appreciated, but I've always appreciated you always. Yeah. He said, then, and I forgot he said that. He said, and that big brand new car, brand new yeah. car. Yeah. Yeah. What? Yeah. Brand new car, big shiny brand new car. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna give you that. Then he said, and I'm gonna give you that brand new house. Yeah. 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 Amen. 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 Brand new house. Yeah. 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 Now, you gotta understand what that means. That means just for me? No, 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 no. That means for all of us. Yeah. 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 Every time I look at a house, I think of Noah. Yeah. I think of Jesus. Certain people I think of. Yeah. Amen. Condos. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, the the uh, what's the, what's that in the trailer park? Mobile, Mobile, Mobile home. home. I think all of that. Yeah. It's where your faith is. Yeah. Right. right. Everybody can't get ten acres. Yeah. Right. Okay, I can. Yeah. What do you got? Right. <laughs> you ain't even bought a car yet. They ain't got no job yet. Okay. Right. Let's just start. Come on now. Yeah. Let's start from. <laughs> And then we got announcements. Department head meeting is already Clemson? We're so it's the time already? So we have a department head meeting at uh, 9 30 at Pastor Clemson's house. That's it? See, there we go, Chris. A good time. <laughs> yeah, good. That is, see, this is the time to bring because it's tomorrow. Yes, sir. You don't want to give the kids. Oh, I have a testimony for the for the for the kids. I heard it today, and it was so good. They said that that, that the child this is that's with us they said we took away the privileges, took away their phone, and changed their school. They was getting D's and F's. Now, no D's and F's. No D's, no F's. Good grades. Attitude has changed. Everything has changed. And they said that we said, and I didn't even know it. One of my leaders had said, this is what you need to do with this person. Single parent, told what you need to do. My wife has done that. I remember... Uh, she was done that with Esther, and I'd be sad. Oh my God, Esther, where's your phone? <laughs> <laughs> Nanny's taking it again. I said, <laughs> and I heard this testimony, Cookie. I have to say to you, I need to repent because I'd be fighting for Esther to get her phone back. But this the same thing has happened with Esther. She's she made a tremendous change. Yeah. Since Amen. Cookie took her phone, because what they do is run in the room. Right. Always running in the room. You never know what they're doing in the room. They always run into the room. Don't want to hear nothing you say, so you tell them they run to the room. No, we, they, they stopped all that. My wife don't allow that. You only go to your room to do your homework, and she's coming in there like Detective, like Dick Tracy. 
or Lois Lane, a reporter. She's in there on you. That's a tremendous testimony when I heard that. I heard that today. That's a tremendous testimony. That you can get your kids right. And Stephanie, it is Stephanie, right? You did not do wrong when you put the hammer on your boy. And that ain't the one next to you. He's come up real strong. Real strong. You did right, I want to tell you. You did right. And you, I, I feel such a, a closeness with you. So many of you. But I feel so, such a closeness with you. You can feel your heart. How much you love us, you got to know. And me and Cookie and my staff love you the same and love your boys the same. And we want the best for you. And you hold it tight on his head. You know what I'm talking about. You hold it tight on his head. You told him right. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it is. Okay. Anything else? No. Ray, God bless you for coming to church, my brother. Amen. I can't believe how strong Ray is. It's Kim. He was at my house all day. I looked at Ray, he was on his knees. I said, What? Big man on his knees? Right. But he had those pads. I said, Thank God. <laughs> he had those right. pads, he was on his knees. They were working, working, working right. out Amen. there. Anyway, so God bless you guys. If you need prayer, okay, we'll give you prayer first thing in the morning. No, if you need, uh, I thought that was good. If you need prayer, I do sense some back, some back, back, neck. I can really, I can pick it as just right now. You have the back, I sense it right now in the back. I know I'm going to pick up the back, but like, what are you doing? Trying to pick up something heavy? Picking up some. As you, you know, you're getting old, Jeff. You, you fit you. <laughs> no, he's, he's tough. You still, you still three plates, right? You're picking up here, so come on out. Three plates, how much is that? What's three plates, Gabriel? 315. Hey, come on now, that's, that's, that's tough. Three plates. Anyway, uh, anything else that you need prayer for? I did say the next. Shoulders. I, I I didn't sense it, but I do feel it with uh, in the in the uh, always the stomach and uh, lack of sleep. What they call that sleep insomnia. But it's another one, sleep insomnia. Right, that's the demon. That's his name. <laughs> We got we to get rid of that. I bind every force of hell up. Yeah. Every force of hell yeah. that's attacking God's people. Yes. Jesus said to, to bind Satan up and rebuke him. Yes. And he would, he would flee. Yeah. And so we bind him yeah. over every person here. We bind him. Yeah. We bind him over, with, oh, that's just over the soul. Yeah. The strains in the soul. I can sense a strain in the soul right across the forehead. Right across the forehead. That's, that's, that's strain in the soul. I bind it up and I release yes. the yes. Prince of Peace. Yes, Lord. The, there's the presence of the Prince of Peace. Yes. If there it is, the flood your soul. Yes, Lord. There was a song that Dinah didn't sing, but she was quoting. And it goes... What was it? When you started it all with prayer. Yeah. Here we are gathered together as a family. Join as one gifting, lifting up our hands to the King of Kings. Is that right? Yes. King of kings, we cry, Abba, Father, holy is your name. We cry, Abba, Father, Let's say it again. Here we are gathered to get a 
so many things God is doing. Creating, create, creating jobs, creating prosperity, creating uh, 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 when, when you get a raises, making ways where there is no way. As we're singing this song, that's what God is doing. I'm just telling you. I can sense it right now. When I put my hands on you, shit, I rebuke this pain in your back. Command it to go. In Jesus' name. And we thank you for it, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for miracles, Lord. Yes. Yes. Miracles for families. Yes. My God is miracles for families. Yes. Miracles, 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 yes. miracles, yes. miracles. Yes. Every time I think about the house, Nola, I never think about a house without thinking about you. Yes. I drive by a house right by my house, and every every day I drive by, I say. I believe that's Nolan's house. So it's a two-story, four-bedroom. Every time I drive by, I say, that's, and that house, that house been there for, must be almost a year. I'm cooking that one in the corner. I said, I think that, that must be Nolan's house. God bless you. God bless you. Did you do the right thing? You bring such joy to, to the Lord when you dance. Yes. You bring such joy to the church when you dance. Yes. You bring so much joy to my heart, yes. Cookie's heart, when you dance. Yes. And you bring joy to your own heart. Yes. We bless you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The storm in your life, I command to cease. The forces of hell that's attacked you, I command them to go. Yeah. Go from you. Yeah. Those foul demons that follow you around, fix my, my I'm under these speaking. It's okay. It's not what it is. Those foul demons that uh, follow you around with, uh, because of the, um, you've got to change your thinking. With your, you know, nobody knows, no one cares, all that stuff. You gotta, you gotta let that stuff go. You gotta gravitate. What you doing? It. You're doing it slowly, and that's how it goes. You've been coming. She been coming, right? What's good? Yeah. She been coming, right, Doc? Yeah. Is this my my uh, J and B restaurant? <laughs> so she been coming. I've been seeing her. She's got the kids, right? Yeah. Where's that knucklehead that you had with you? He's back there? Yeah. Why's he back there? Should he be up here? Yeah. Not holding hands, but he should, should be up here if we go better. I like the way he answered up though. Yeah. That was good. Because I'm only I'm only joking. He had no my heart. I didn't know he was there, so forgive me. <laughs> forgive me. Hallelujah. I appreciate you being with her. I appreciate you being with her. Bless you. Bless you. We stand with you, girl. Yes. God has been working miracles from the day you came. And he's going to continue. So your, your foundation is secure. It's solid. And your kids, you got to realize there's a cycle. The kids will come all the way back. Yeah. You cannot, you cannot never keep kids from a mother. That's right. Right. It don't matter. It don't matter if the court system. It don't matter. It don't matter right. what the judge said, what they lied. All that don't matter. If the children will always come back to mom. Right. It, it, it'll be time. Time goes by. I remember I was, a few, I was, I told you they sent me away. I forgot it. I didn't tell you guys. I was the first one to go back. <laughs> After they, we left from my, my mother and went to my father, I was the first one to go back. Out of, out of, out of the five, I went back, first one. And I took all my brothers and my sisters back. I said, we got to go back and see mama. Amen. And I never broke again from her. But I, anyway, that's a whole nother story. But I, I tried to tell you, and I don't know if I did a good job about my bacon and eggs. Bless you. I like my breakfast. I like my biscuits. 
I like my seafood. I like my fish, my shrimp, my crabs, my crawfish. I like it. And I said, I'm not going to eat it. I'm going to eat it. They say, you're going to die? Well, I'm going to eat it and then die. They said, I'm not going to stop. That's it. Sorry. I may let the pig go for a minute, but I ain't letting the seafood go. That's right. No, I'm not going to do it. What's up, boy? And bless you. Where's the little girl? She's going to be always there. What is she? Is she getting her blessing over there? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm coming, boy. Bless you. I love you. Bless you. Give you the strength to do what we talked about today. I believe you will. Yes. Feel that power? You like that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see you do. <laughs> we always like that power. Hallelujah. We love that power. Yeah. Power of love. Okay. So we got everything, that's it? Yeah. All right, God bless you. Yeah. We'll see you... Uh, at the department head meeting and the other one we'll see